Hey guys, my name is Jacob from Running Wild here in Pensacola, Florida. And in today's video, I'm gonna be talking all about on running shoes. I'll break down what makes them unique from other uh, running shoe brands. And then I'll get into three different models that we carry here in the store. And then I'll kind of go into the differences in the shoes and how they differ from one another. So the first thing you'll notice what makes ONS unique is they use what's called CloudTech cushioning system. And that's these little pods right here. Uh, and basically the idea with those is uh, that each of these pods is gonna kind of crush down as your foot strikes. And then as you toe off, those pods are gonna rebound back and give you a nice energetic toe off. The other benefit of this technology that's unique from other running shoe brands is it really breaks the midsole of the shoe up into these different zones. So it's kind of, it's a more dynamic movement with the shoe as your foot moves through the gait cycle. And it's kind of catering to that specific point on your foot rather than um, having one slab of foam that's kind of reacting as one unit. Uh, the other thing you'll notice is all the on shoes have this plate in the bottom called a speed board. Now a speed board is designed to basically flex with your foot as you go through the gait cycle, just like this. And then uh, as you kind of toe off, that shoe's gonna rebound back nice and crisp and give you a really energetic feel. That's, that's kind of a summary of the technology On uses. And that brings us to the first shoe, which is the On Cloud. Um, now this shoe is extremely versatile. Uh, it's lightweight. It incorporates kind of all its key technology that makes On's On's. Um, and this shoe is really just designed to be a kind of a great do everything type of shoe that can be used for a quick session at the gym. Uh, a light run or just kind of for casual use walking around town grabbing a cup of coffee um, and it comes in a bunch of different kind of colors and styles and looks so you can kind of get a specific shoe for the outfit you're wearing that day um, but it's got still a bit of running capability to it so if you're a person who likes to you know go to work and then you can get out for your run right after work this shoe might be a great option for you, or if you're a big traveler, it's lightweight, fits right in the bag, and uh, you can jump off the plane and go for your run. Um, but I definitely would consider this more of a casual shoe with running capabilities than the other way around. So the next model in the lineup is called the Cloud Flow. This shoe's a little bit more geared towards performance than the Cloud. It incorporates the same great technology, um, but this shoe's gonna have quite a bit more support here in the upper to hold your foot more securely and offer a little bit more stability if you're out doing speed work or you're running a little bit longer distances. Um, the midsole in this shoe, you can see it's a little bit more sleek. Uh, it's a, a bit more responsive of a foam and uh, it's a little, again, more specific to running than a shoe like the On Cloud. Uh, you can see it's got a much more robust lacing system here. That's just gonna, again, really hold your foot in the shoe and not allow you to squirm around if you're out doing track work or on a tempo run type of thing. So Cloud Flow is a great option, kind of minimal as far as cushioning goes, but it's gonna have the same features and geometry as the On Cloud. So the third and final model I'd like to talk about in today's video is the Cloud Flyer. This is the most structured of the on lineup, and this shoe is going to give you the most cushioning and the most um, stability out of any of the three shoes I've gone over. So you'll see the midsole in this shoe, each of these clouds is quite a bit thicker um, than you saw on the Cloud Flow and on the regular Cloud. Um, so what that shoe is going to do is it's going to give you quite a bit more cushioning. Uh, it's going to still feature that speed board like the other two shoes. Um, and another great feature of this shoe that I like personally is that the toe box is quite a bit wider. So if you've got a wider uh, toe or forefoot like I do, um, some of the other on models feel a little bit on the narrow side. And this shoe gives you a little bit more room to move around and uh, help stabilize your foot. So this is a great option if you're looking to do longer runs or you're just looking for a little bit more cushion than the other two shoes offer. Um, so that's a quick rundown on the models we carry here in the store. And if you have any questions about uh, on running shoes or running in general, please don't hesitate to ask in the comments section of the video and I'll do my best to answer them all. If you got anything out of this video, please hit the like button and be sure to subscribe to the channel. I hope you're all staying fit and healthy and I'll see you in the next video. Happy running.